to the Most High God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. For truly this is the day the Lord has made and we will rejoice and be glad in it. We welcome you tuning in to the Hewitt channel. My name is Evangelist Anita Hewitt. My husband and I, Pastor Brian and myself, we love you with the love of the Lord. If no one else told you that you're loved, you're loved by Anita and the man. Pastor Brian and Anita Hewitt, we love you with the love of the Lord. Glory to God. Let's go before the throne. Most gracious Father, we come before you right now, Lord, in the matchless name of Jesus. Father God, we love you. We praise you. Father God, forgive us for all of our sins. Strengthen us where we're weak. Father God, we thank you and praise you that this is the day the Lord has made, and we will rejoice and be glad in it. And Father God, we just thank you for every blessing you have for us this day. Father God, we thank you for a teachable spirit. We thank you, Lord Jesus. We're walking in divine health for every organ, every tissue in our body is functioning in the perfection which God. God created to function we will continue on giving you praise giving you glory for there's none like you in the matchless name of Jesus now father God we thank you Lord Jesus for the blessings that shall overtake us today father God we thank you for a teachable spirit we thank you Lord Jesus that not one word shall fall upon deaf ears but it shall accomplish that it was sent to do and father God will be careful to give you all the praise all the glory for there's none like you in the matchless name of Jesus. Amen and amen. God bless you, saints of the Most High God. Our ministry is MCN Ministry. We're located in Los Angeles, California. If you need more information, please visit our website at www.brianhewitt.com. And if you want to seed into this fertile ministry, for truly we're going to the four winds of the earth. We just came back from Africa in December, and we're planning to go to London, England. Um, within a few months. So God is blessing and if you want to see it into this ministry, click on the donation button and if you want to write a check, please make it payable to MCN Ministry because the Word of God says, who will go for me? And the Word truly says, send me and I'll go. So we're going to the four winds of the earth, wherever the Lord is sending us, we're going to share the gospel of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Let's dive into the Word. Today the Lord has put, placed on my heart Saints of the Most High God, I know we're going through a lot of things. Hallelujah. But the Word of God says, hang in there. Don't give up. Hang in there, saints of the Most High God. Don't give up. Hallelujah. Glory to God. I have a few scriptures we're going to dive into. So please get your pen and your piece of paper and get a Bible. Follow with us. Hallelujah. Because, hallelujah, I'm excited to share the Word of God. Our first scripture is taken from Galatians 6 and 9. And let us not get weary in well-doing, for in due season we shall reap if we faint not. Hallelujah. Saints of the Most High God, hang in there. Don't give up. Don't get weary in well-doing. Hallelujah. You've done a good work. Hallelujah. You're on this race. Hallelujah. Don't stop now because the Bible says you ran a good race, but who hindered you? So don't get weary in well-doing for in due season you shall reap if we faint not. Isn't it amazing that we get right at the brick of our blessing and we get weary and we and, and we stop our own blessing. We say, oh God, it's never going to happen anyway. Then we stopped our blessing. Hallelujah. But God says, hallelujah, don't faint not. Hallelujah. In other words, don't stop. Hallelujah. Because you've done a good work. Hallelujah. The Bible says, he that started a good work in you will complete. Hallelujah. He will finish until the day of completion. Hallelujah. God has started a good work in you. He's not through with you yet hallelujah don't throw in the towel no matter how hard it is no matter what storms of life you're going through hallelujah we can do all things through Christ which strengthens us hallelujah because the joy of the Lord is our strength so we must we rest in God's word. We must rejoice in God and know that God is going to bring us through every situation that we're going through. Saints of the Most High God, I want you to understand that. Hallelujah. Be encouraged. Hallelujah. Turn with me to Isaiah 40. Hallelujah. 28 through 31. Hallelujah. Has thou not known? Has thou not heard? that the everlasting God 
the Lord, the creator of the ends of the earth, faith faileth not, neither is weary. Mm -mm -mm. There is no searching of his understanding. He giveth power to the faint, and to them that have no might, he increased the strength. Glory to God. Even the youth shall faint and be weary, and the young men shall utterly fall. But they that wait on the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings as eagles. They shall run and not be weary. They shall walk and not faint. Saints of the Most High God, hallelujah, don't give up. Hallelujah, the Lord woke me up early. Hallelujah, my husband and I, and hallelujah, it was 1.30 in the morning, and I just laid on my bed, and I said, God, hallelujah, thank you for your word. The word today is don't give up. Hallelujah, hang in there. Don't give up. Hang in there, saints of the Most High God. The enemy wants us, the enemy of our soul wants us to throw in the towel and say, what is it? It ain't nothing about serving Jesus. Hallelujah. But the devil is a lie. Hallelujah. Glory to God. I'm here to tell you. Hallelujah. To give. I speak strength to you right now. Lord, in the name of Jesus, I speak peace right now. The peace of God which passes all understanding shall keep our heart and mind through Christ Jesus. Hallelujah. I speak peace right now, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Glory to God the peace of the Lord hallelujah the joy of the Lord is our strength hallelujah and God wants us to have that overflowing joy hallelujah he wants us to have that bubbling joy that flows and bubbles all over hallelujah so we thank God for the joy of the Lord is truly our strength today glory to God hallelujah hang in there saints of the most high God hang in there my brother and my sister hallelujah my Mother and father of the church, senior, seniors, hallelujah, young people, teenagers, and children, glory to God, hang in there, pastors, leaders, hallelujah, don't close the doors, hallelujah, glory to God, hallelujah, don't faint, hallelujah, because in due season, too many times we want God to move on our time clock, hallelujah, too many times we wait on God and say, God, I've been waiting, God, God, it's been a prophecy five years ago and it still has not came to pass hallelujah but I'm here to tell you to hang in there don't give up God is never late God is always on time and in due season he shall bless hallelujah if we faint not hallelujah if is a very small word but it's conditional hallelujah if we don't curse our own blessing if we don't stop our own blessing isn't it amazing hallelujah when God says he's going to bless us hallelujah and we've been walking around saying thank you Jesus God is going to bless us but when it's not our time when it doesn't move in the time frame we feel that God should be moving then all of a sudden hallelujah we start saying well God maybe I maybe that wasn't for me anyway hallelujah we will have whatever we speak saints of the most high God hallelujah we live in a voice activated system if God spoke everything into existence and God said greater work shall we do don't you know we have power in the tongue whatever we say we could either bless our blessing we could either praise God and receive our blessing or we could curse our blessing and it will not come to pass why because we spoke over it so watch what we say so saints of the most high God again I want you to know I want you to hang in there and don't give up thank you Jesus hallelujah because the Bible says I love the water hallelujah because it's refreshing Hallelujah. It reminds me of the word of God. It says, out of your belly shall flow rivers of living water. Hallelujah. We thank God for the living water today. Hallelujah. But hallelujah, saints of the most high God, I want you to know, hang in there. Don't give up. 
life circumstances has a way of making us get weary hallelujah and god knew that we would get on this christian walk we would get weary but long as we stay connected to the father long as we look unto the hills from which cometh our help know that our help cometh from the lord which made heaven and earth hallelujah my eyes are stayed on thee whose mind is stayed on thee that he'll keep in perfect peace hallelujah so we must keep our mind stayed on christ jesus hallelujah i can't i can't look at the circumstances i'm not denying the fact the fact is this hallelujah I'm not denying it. Hallelujah. But I know God is greater than whatever situation I'm facing right now. I know God is greater. God is going to bring me up and out of every situation that I'm facing today because I trust in him. Hallelujah. And the word of God says, do not give up. Hallelujah. The word of God says, hallelujah. Let us not get weary in well-doing, for in due season we shall reap. That's a promise. We shall reap if we faint not. Hallelujah. And today, hallelujah, I might have got weary, but I'm not fainting. I'm not throwing in the towel. I'm not saying that that's it. I give up. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. I speak strength. I speak stick to this. Hallelujah. We're going to stand. Hallelujah. We're going to be like that tree in Psalms 1. Hallelujah. That's planted by the rivers of water. Hallelujah. Where the roots grow deep. Hallelujah. It never said, hallelujah, that the tree won't bend. Hallelujah. Life circumstances has a way of making us lean back and forth. But hallelujah, we're not going to break. Hallelujah. Glory to God. And even if we may fall, hallelujah, the Bible says the righteous man falleth seven times, but he rises back up. Isn't it amazing? Hallelujah. I may fall. Hallelujah. I may fall and may get weary. Hallelujah. But I can't lay there. Why? Because God has that tenacity in you. Hallelujah. I like to say, hallelujah, back in the day when my son was little, hallelujah, it was called the Weeble Wobbles. We may wibble, we may sway, but we won't fall down. Hallelujah. That's the same thing that we have in Christ Jesus. We may sway a little bit. Hallelujah. But guess what? I'm not going to fall down. And even if I do, hallelujah, the Bible says a righteous man fall it seven times but he rises back up hallelujah and glory to god today is not the day for me to faint i'm not going to throw in the towel today hallelujah because god has been too good to me hallelujah he did not throw in the towel when i wanted to give up god says no baby get back up hallelujah you can do all things through christ which strengthens thee hallelujah we are more than a conqueror through christ jesus the Bible says, lift up your heads, O ye gates, and be ever lifted up, for the King of glory shall come in. Who is this King of glory? The Lord strong and mighty. Hallelujah. So I want you to know, to raise up your head. Hallelujah. Know who you are in Christ Jesus. The Bible says, we're the heads and not the tails. Hallelujah. We are the lenders and not the borrows. Hallelujah. We are above and not beneath. Hallelujah. Glory to God. In Psalms 139 and 14. That's one of my favorite scriptures. Hallelujah. I will praise thee because I'm fearfully and wonderfully made. Marvelous are thy works and my soul knoweth right well. Hallelujah. We know who we are in Christ Jesus. I might have been weary right now, but now that I heard the word of God, hallelujah, I'm rejuvenated. Hallelujah. Isn't it amazing? Glory to God that God's word gives you strength. Hallelujah. God's word encourage you, saints of the most high God. God's word will give you strength whenever we are weary. Hallelujah. So we must dive into the word of God. Hallelujah. Today, I want to give you some scriptures on don't give up. Glory to God. Turn with me to 1 Corinthians 10 and 13. Hallelujah. No temptation has overtaken you that it is not common to man. God is faithful, and he will not let you be tempted beyond your able. 
But with the temptation, he will also provide a way of escape so that you'll be able to endure it. Glory to God. I'm reading from another version of a Bible, but it's 1 Corinthians 10 and 13. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Turn with me to Jeremiah 29 and 11. Hallelujah. For I know the plans I have for you, declare the Lord. Plans for, for welfare and not for evil. To give you a future and a hope. Hallelujah. Our future is in Christ Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to God. We're hanging in there. We're not giving up. Hallelujah. Today is the day that the Lord has made and I will rejoice and be glad in it. Hallelujah. And because of that, I'm giving God the praise and glory. God has been too good, hallelujah, to us, hallelujah, for us to throw in the towel. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son, that whosoever believeth in him shall not perish, but have everlasting life. And today we have everlasting life. But if you don't know the Lord as your personal savior, now is the acceptable time for you to get it right. Hallelujah. And God wants us to get it right. So turn with me to Romans 10, verse 9 through 13. Hallelujah that if thou shalt confess with thy mouth the Lord Jesus, and thou shalt believe in thine heart that God has raised him from the dead, thou shalt be saved. For with the heart man believes unto righteousness, with the mouth confession is made unto salvation. For the scripture says, whosoever, whosoever shall call upon the name of the Lord, whosoever shall call, who shall oh my God, I'm thinking of whosoever shall call upon the name of the Lord. The scripture says, Whosoever shall call shall not be ashamed. Hallelujah. But there is no difference between the Jew and the Greek. And the same Lord is over the same Lord is over all that is rich upon all that call upon him. For whosoever shall call upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. Hallelujah. Aren't you glad that hallelujah, glory to God, that we love him and we call upon the name of the Lord. It says, for whosoever shall call upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. Aren't you glad, hallelujah, that we are part of the whosoever club. Hallelujah. For the scripture says, whosoever believeth on him shall not be ashamed. We're not ashamed of the gospel of Jesus Christ today. And because of that, we're standing on God's word. And because of that, we're hanging in there and we're not giving up. Hallelujah, the Bible says, please repeat this scripture after, please repeat this prayer after me. Dear God, I admit I'm a sinner. I need your forgiveness. I believe that Jesus Christ died in my place, paying the penalty for my sins. I'm willing right now to turn my sins and accept Jesus Christ as my personal Lord and Savior. I commit myself to you and ask you to send the Holy Spirit into my life to fill me and take control and help me to become the person you birthed me to become. Thank you, Father, for loving me. In Jesus' name. If you said that simple prayer, all heaven is rejoicing. Pastor Brian and myself, we're praising God for you. Praise God. Glory to God. We're praising God for you. And we say, Lord, we thank you. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Welcome to the body of Christ. You have taken the first, you have taken the first step. Hallelujah. And glory to God. Once again, welcome to the body of Christ. And glory to God. Now you ask God to lead and guide you to a Bible teaching church where that God wants you to grow and get strengthened and also get active in the midweek Bible study for where there's unity, there is strength. Faith comes by hearing and hearing comes from the word of God. God wants us to go from faith to faith to glory to glory. And that's the only way that we could do it is when we fellowship in God's house. Hallelujah. And if you don't have a church home, I welcome you to come and fellowship with us on Sundays at 1130. Our address is on our website. And if you want to seed into this ministry, please visit our website at www.brianhewitt.com. And also, if you want to uh, write a check, please make it payable to MCN Ministry. Bible Way LA. 
Once again, welcome to the body of Christ. And please let us know also that you gave your life to the Lord. And if and if you need a Bible, please let us know that too. We will make sure you get one. Once again, welcome to the body of Christ. Let's go back to hang in there. Don't give up. Hallelujah. Glory to God. So the scripture says, we just read Jeremiah 29 and 11. For I know the plans I have for you, declare the Lord. Plans for welfare and not for evil to give you a future and a hope glory to god hallelujah glory to god hallelujah don't you don't you know that god has a plan for you hallelujah and the enemy of your soul want to tell you that there's nothing to it the enemy of your soul wants you to throw in the towel but god hallelujah wants you to hang in there saints of the most high god hallelujah i'm telling you the lord woke me up early in the wee parts of the morning. Holly, I woke up my husband and said, this is what the Lord gave me today. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Turn with me to 2 Thessalonians 3 and 13. Hallelujah. As for you, brothers, do not grow weary in doing good. Hallelujah. Glory to God. So that word is for us. Saints of the Most High God, I want you to understand. Hallelujah, my brothers and sisters. Hallelujah. Don't get weary. Don't grow weary in doing good. Hallelujah. God wants us to do good. God wants us. Hallelujah. It is our desire for us to walk up rightly. It's God's desire that we walk up rightly in his sight. Hallelujah. And we're doing good. Hallelujah. Glory to God. We're sharing the word of God. We're praying with our brothers and sisters and knowing that God is going to see us through every situation. I want you to understand. Hallelujah. Don't you know glory to God that God loves us so much God gives us his grace and mercy because the wedges of sin is death but the gift of God is eternal life through Christ Jesus our Lord that's Romans 6 and 6 and 23 glory to God hallelujah aren't you glad that God has not given us the full hallelujah punishment of our sin saints of the most high God hallelujah I want you to know hallelujah in God's due season hallelujah a lot of times we want to know when God when 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 Lord when is this going to happen God when is this but hallelujah they that wait upon the Lord hallelujah shall renew their strength they shall mount up with wings as an eagle hallelujah glory to God and I want you to know hallelujah that we shall wait on the Lord today hallelujah they shall run and not get weary they shall walk and not faint glory to God so we're waiting on the Lord today is that your testimony today today I'm waiting on the Lord I'm not giving up hallelujah no matter what it looks like hallelujah the Bible says look not onto the things which are seen for the things which are seen are subject to change but the things that are, that we cannot see that they're everlasting and they are eternal hallelujah so we're looking on to the author and the finisher of our faith hallelujah God loves you saints of the most high God God wants you to hang in there and don't give up no matter what it looks like hallelujah God will protect you God will bring you through every situation hallelujah we just read that there is no temptation hallelujah that is common unto man hallelujah God is faithful and he will not let you be tempted beyond your, your beyond your ability hallelujah but with every temptation hallelujah he will also provide a way of escape that you may be able to endure it glory to God in the temp in in of the King James it said you'll be able to bear it hallelujah glory to God God will give us a way of escape hallelujah out of every temptation that we're facing today saints of the most high God I want you to understand hallelujah that God loves you hallelujah do not throw in the towel isn't it amazing that we th we give God the towel and God throws it back in our face saying I'm not through with you yet my brother and sister I'm not through with you senior citizen I'm not through with you mother and father of the church hallelujah God has a great work God said a good work he started in you that he will complete hallelujah so he's still
still working on this vessel. And aren't you glad, hallelujah, that we're still on the potter's wheel? Aren't you glad that God is still making this vessel a vessel of honor? Hallelujah, because before we didn't know the Lord, we were a vessel of dishonor. But today, glory to God, we're a vessel of honor. Now we're a vessel of honor. God wants you to hang in there and don't give up. Don't get tired. Hallelujah. We serve a God who doesn't get who doesn't slumber nor sleep. That means we serve a God who never gets tired. He never gets weary. Hallelujah. God's ears are always open to his children. God will answer every situation, every problem that we're facing. God wants us to cast those cares upon him for he cares for you, saints of the most high God. So I'm here to let you know, glory to God, don't give up. Hallelujah. Hang in there. Hallelujah. It reminds me back in the day there used to be a poster of a little cat hanging on hallelujah with his little claws saying hang in there hallelujah sometimes we're like that we're just hanging in there we may be hanging on the thread of Jesus but long as said you touch the garment hallelujah I know I'll be whole be like that woman with the with the issue of blood. Hallelujah. She said, if I only just touch the hem of his garment, I know I'll be made whole. Hallelujah. Sometimes we're hanging on a thread. Hallelujah. But long as that thread is connected to the Father, I know I'm going to be all right. Hallelujah. God is going to bring you up and out of every situation. Hallelujah. I want to let you know. I want you to look back and see how faithful God has been. Hallelujah. God has been faithful. Saints of the Most High God. He's brought you out of this and you know he's going to bring you out of that. Hallelujah. God has never lost a case. Hallelujah. He's never let you down. Glory to God. He's never left you. God said I'll never leave you nor forsake you even if you make your bed in hell. I'll be there. But today we're not making our bed in hell. Today heaven is our home. Hallelujah. And for that we thank God for this powerful word. Hallelujah. We're not going to give up. We're hanging in there and we're not going to give up. Why? Because the scripture says, hang in there. Galatians 6 and 9. Hallelujah. Isaiah 40, 28 through 31. Hallelujah. They that wait on the Lord. Hallelujah. And Galatians 6 and 9. Hallelujah. Let us not get weary in well-doing. For in due season we shall reap if we faint not. Hallelujah. And today, my saints of the Most High God, we're not fainting. We're not even tired. Hallelujah. Why? Because we're waiting on the Lord. Hallelujah. And God has given us our daily strength. Hallelujah. He strengthened us through the word of God. I might have been weary maybe 28 minutes ago, but now that I heard the word of God, hallelujah, I'm not tired yet. Hallelujah. And I'm not looking back and I'm not about to give up. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Let's give God praise and glory. Hallelujah for this awesome word of God. Saints of the most high God, I want you to hang in there. Don't give up because God is not through with you yet. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Let's pray out. Most gracious Father, we come before you right now, Lord, in the matchless name of Jesus. Father God, we love you. We thank you for this awesome word of God. We thank you, Lord Jesus, for those that dedicated their lives to the Lord today. Let them be forever changed. Hallelujah. We thank God for the powerful, anointed word word of God that destroys every yoke. Hallelujah, Lord. We thank you for the anointing that makes preaching and teaching easy. Hallelujah. Glory to God. We thank you, Lord. Now, Father God, I thank you, Lord Jesus, for you protecting us all day long, whatever time zone we're in, if it's our day, morning, or evening. Father God, we thank you, Lord Jesus, for your divine protection. Now, Father God, we thank you, Lord Jesus, for being with us always. Hallelujah. And Lord, we will hide this word in our heart that we will not sin against thee and lord will be careful to give you all the praise all the glory for there is none like you in the matchless name of jesus glory to god amen tune back in at three o'clock p.m pacific standard time and six o'clock p.m my husband pastor brian will be teaching from the book of revelation get ready to be blessed so until we meet again may god bless you and keep you amen glory to god <music>